Novelsnet.com, and Dreamweaver Studio. Mrs. Watanabe's Impact on Forex, How Japanese Housewives Dominate Global Trading, prepared by Itafuerki Melaku. From the quiet, unassuming homes scattered across Japan, a silent revolution has taken place. Behind the doors of these suburban households, a new kind of trader was born. Meet Mrs. Watanabe. Mrs. Watanabe is not a financial expert, nor does she work in a bank. She is, in fact, an ordinary housewife. But don't let her calm demeanor fool you. She is a part of a growing force of retail forex traders who, from the comfort of their homes, have reshaped the global currency markets. The world knows them as Mrs. Watanabe, a collective name for the millions of Japanese retail investors, mostly women, who, in the early 2000s, began to dominate forex trading. With low interest rates at home and easy access to online trading platforms, these housewives found a way to not only supplement their income, but also become influential players in a market once controlled by large financial institutions. They may not wear suits or work in glass towers, but these women have left an indelible mark on global currency trading. Their trades, though small in size individually, collectively shook the foundations of the Forex market. A quiet revolution, born in the heart of Japan's households, has become one of the most significant movements in financial history. So, who is Mrs. Watanabe? And how did she, along with countless others, manage to challenge the giants of global finance? This is the story of the rise of the retail forex trader. In the world of global forex trading, one name stands out. Not of a single individual, but of an entire demographic. Mrs. Watanabe. This term refers to Japanese housewives who have become a significant force within the financial markets. Over the years, these retail forex traders have emerged as influential players in the global forex market, using their domestic roles and financial insight to engage in currency trading from their homes. This video will explore how Mrs. Watanabe utilized innovative strategies like the yen carry trade, which involves borrowing Japanese yen at low interest rates and investing in higher yielding currencies. We'll break down how these traders capitalized on global interest rate differentials, reshaped global currency trading, and influenced exchange rates worldwide. Expect to learn key Forex trading tips from Mrs. Watanabe's strategies. Discover how retail investors have impacted global Forex trends and find actionable lessons that modern investors can apply in today's market. The video will include visuals on the rise of Japanese housewives in Forex, detailed charts of Forex movements, and strategies for succeeding in retail Forex trading. The Unseen Influence of Mrs. Watanabe How Japanese Investors Drive Global Forex Movements While major financial institutions and hedge funds often take the spotlight in global forex markets, the influence of Japanese investors, particularly Mrs. Watanabe, is substantial yet frequently overlooked. These retail forex traders, predominantly Japanese housewives, have played a significant role in driving global forex movements often dictating market trends and currency flows in ways that even the largest institutional traders must respect. At the heart of Mrs. Watanabe's influence is the ability to move capital swiftly across borders, leveraging Japan's historically low interest rates to participate in the lucrative yen carry trade. By borrowing yen at low rates and investing in currencies with higher returns, Japanese investors have created a ripple effect that extends far beyond their domestic market. This strategic capital flow has caused shifts in global forex trends, impacting currency valuations, global trade balances, and even central bank policies. More importantly, the sheer number of Japanese retail forex traders amplifies their impact. Collectively, these small-scale investors hold considerable weight in global forex markets, shaping trends that professional traders and large institutions must account for in their strategies. This unseen influence of Mrs. Watanabe demonstrates the power of a dispersed but highly motivated group of investors capable of driving market movements from their living rooms. Lessons from Mrs. Watanabe on dominating retail Forex. Ms. Watanabe's Forex strategy offers valuable insights for today's retail investors. Her approach, centered around risk management, patience, and leveraging global macroeconomic trends, provides a blueprint for dominating the highly volatile Forex market. One key lesson from Mrs. Watanabe is the importance of understanding interest rate differentials. By mastering the intricacies of the yen carry trade, 
retail Forex traders can capitalize on favorable borrowing conditions and invest in higher yielding assets abroad. Another crucial takeaway is risk mitigation through diversification. Japanese investors often spread their investments across multiple currencies to reduce exposure to any single market, balancing risk with potential returns. Finally, Mrs. Watanabe's strategy highlights the significance of long-term thinking. These investors are known for their patience and ability to withstand short-term volatility, focusing on steady, incremental gains. For modern retail Forex traders, adopting these lessons, disciplined risk management, strategic currency selection, and long-term vision can lead to sustained success in the global Forex market. How Mrs. Watanabe became a symbol of Japanese retail Forex investors. The term Mrs. Watanabe has become synonymous with Japanese retail Forex investors, particularly housewives who began engaging in currency trading from their homes. Originally, Mrs. Watanabe was a cultural shorthand used to describe the average Japanese housewife who managed household finances. However, as Japan's economy experienced prolonged low interest rates, many of these women sought new ways to grow their savings, leading them into the world of Forex trading. The origins of Mrs. Watanabe as a financial symbol can be traced back to the 1990s and early 2000s, when Japanese housewives, armed with access to online trading platforms and a desire to earn higher returns on their savings, began participating in the Forex market. Their foray into trading was not driven by speculation alone, but by a carefully calculated strategy that sought to take advantage of global interest rate differentials. Over time, this demographic grew in influence becoming a key component of Japan's retail Forex sector, which remains one of the largest in the world. The rise of Mrs. Watanabe exemplifies the intersection of cultural factors and financial opportunity. According to research published by Ito and Yabu, 2015, Onbin Retail traders in Japan were responsible for a significant portion of the currency trading volumes, with Mrs. Watanabe accounting for a substantial part of this activity. Their savvy strategies and collective trading volume made Mrs. Watanabe a symbolic figurehead of the Japanese retail forex community. What Mrs. Watanabe's strategies teach modern retail investors. The financial strategies employed by Mrs. Watanabe offer timeless lessons for today's retail forex traders. Her approach to forex trading was characterized by disciplined risk management, an understanding of global economic conditions, and strategic use of leverage. One of the primary strategies employed by Japanese housewives in Forex, including Mrs. Watanabe, was diversification across currency pairs. Rather than placing large bets on a single currency, these investors would spread their investments across multiple currencies, mitigating the risks associated with market volatility. In today's volatile Forex landscape, diversification remains one of the most important Forex trading tips for any retail trader. Another core lesson is the use of carry trades, where retail investors like Mrs. Watanabe borrowed yen at low interest rates to invest in higher yielding currencies. This strategy allowed them to generate steady returns over time. Modern retail investors can still apply this principle, focusing on interest rate differentials as a way to profit in the current global economic environment. As noted by researchers like Chabud et al. 2009, the influence of retail traders on price stability and currency fluctuations demonstrates that even small investors can impact the Forex market when acting in large numbers. Learning from Mrs. Watanabe's Forex strategy, today's retail traders should focus on long-term gains, use leverage cautiously, and remain adaptable to shifts in global markets. The rise of Mrs. Watanabe in the late 90s and early 2000s the emergence of Mrs. Watanabe as a prominent figure in forex trading began during Japan's economic stagnation in the 1990s. Facing near zero interest rates and a sluggish domestic economy, Japanese housewives, along with other retail traders, sought alternative means of income. The widespread adoption of internet trading platforms in the late 1990s and early 2000s gave them unprecedented access to global forex markets, and with that, an opportunity to trade currencies directly. The rise of Japanese Forex traders during this period was marked by their increasing involvement in carry trade strategies, where they would borrow yen at exceptionally low rates 
and invest in foreign assets with higher yields, such as Australian dollars or Turkish lira. The economic phenomenon known as the lost decade in Japan fueled this trend. As households look to overseas investments to compensate for weak returns at home, by the early 2000s, Japanese retail traders, driven largely by housewives, had become a dominant force in global forex markets. According to research by Galati, Heath, and Maguire, 2007, the volume of retail forex trading by Mrs. Watanabe and other Japanese investors had a notable influence on currency trends, especially in emerging markets. How the carry trade strategy worked for Mrs. Watanabe The carry trade strategy became one of the most effective tools for Mrs. Watanabe in the forex market. In simple terms, the carry trade involves borrowing money in a currency with low interest rates, such as the Japanese yen, and investing it in a currency with higher interest rates. By capitalizing on the difference in interest rates, investors earn the spread between the borrowing cost and the investment return. For Mrs. Watanabe, this strategy was particularly profitable due to Japan's prolonged period of ultra-low interest rates. By borrowing yen at near zero rates and investing in currencies such as the Australian dollar or Brazilian real, which offered higher yields, these retail forex traders could generate a consistent return on their investments. In the process, they contributed to massive capital flows from Japan to other parts of the world, affecting global currency valuations. A study by Burnside et al., 2011, explains how carry trades, while lucrative, carry risks such as sudden currency reversals due to market volatility. Despite these risks, Mrs. Watanabe for forex trading strategies proved resilient, as they often managed to hedge their positions through diversification, minimizing potential losses from unexpected market shifts. The yen carry trade strategy remains a textbook example of how small retail investors can leverage global economic trends to their advantage. For modern retail traders, understanding and applying similar macroeconomic strategies can be a pathway to success in today's interconnected financial markets. Key Forex Trading Strategies from Mrs. Watanabe for Modern Investors The enduring success of Mrs. Watanabe offers invaluable lessons for retail Forex traders today. By examining the strategies used by these Japanese retail investors, particularly housewives, modern traders can glean insights into how to navigate the complex and often volatile Forex market. The approach of Mrs. Watanabe combines long-term risk management with a keen understanding of macroeconomic trends, offering a blueprint for both new and seasoned investors. One of the key strategies is leveraging interest rate differentials, as exemplified in the yen carry trade. This strategy, where investors borrow yen at low interest rates and invest in higher yielding currencies, has remained a cornerstone for generating steady returns. Modern traders can replicate this approach by carefully tracking global interest rates and identifying currencies that offer favorable carry opportunities. As financial expert Karen Gilchrist, CNBC 2019 notes, the carry trade continues to be a relevant tactic, particularly in periods of global economic divergence. Another vital lesson is diversification. Japanese housewives spread their investments across multiple currency pairs to mitigate risk, a strategy that can be especially important in today's volatile Forex environment. By avoiding overexposure to any single market, modern retail traders can reduce the impact of sudden market fluctuations, which are common in Forex trading. Furthermore, patience and long-term vision are crucial traits seen in Mrs. Watanabe's trading habits. Many of these traders avoided short-term speculation in favor of gradual gains over time. According to a report by Galati et al., 2007, Japanese retail investors exhibited a disciplined approach to trading which helped them sustain profitability even during market downturns. Modern traders can learn from this measured approach, focusing on sustained growth rather than chasing quick profits. How Japanese retail investors transformed global forex markets, the influx of retail forex traders from Japan, particularly during the 1990s and early 2000s, has significantly reshaped the global forex market. This transformation was largely driven by Mrs. Watanabe, whose collective investments influenced currency valuations and market trends. By strategically shifting their capital across various global markets, Japanese retail investors contributed to massive capital flows that impacted not only Forex, but also broader financial markets.
One of the most profound effects of these retail investors was the creation of greater liquidity in the Forex market. The large volume of small-scale transactions, as driven by retail traders like Mrs. Watanabe, added depth to currency markets, which in turn improved market efficiency and price discovery. According to Galati, Heath, and McGuire, BIS Quarterly Review, 2007, the participation of retail investors, especially from Japan, provided a stabilizing force in the market, particularly in currency pairs like USDJPY. Additionally, their strategic use of carry trades had a ripple effect on global currency movements. By borrowing yen and investing in higher yielding currencies like the Australian dollar, Japanese retail traders not only profited, but also contributed to the strengthening of these target currencies. As economist Takatoshi Ito pointed out in a 2015 study, the actions of Japanese retail investors often aligned with larger macroeconomic shifts, amplifying their overall influence on currency markets. How Tech Innovations Amplify Mrs. Watanabe's Forex Influence The legacy of Mrs. Watanabe has been further amplified by advances in modern Forex trading technology. Today, online platforms and mobile applications have democratized access to the Forex market enabling a new generation of retail investors to follow in the footsteps of Japanese housewives who dominated Forex trading in the past. Technology in Forex has revolutionized how retail traders operate. Automated trading algorithms, real-time data feeds, and intuitive trading platforms like MetaTrader have leveled the playing field for individual investors. As finance expert Chris Taylor, Reuters 2018 explains, these tools allow traders to react instantly to market shifts enabling more precise execution of strategies like carry trades, which once required constant monitoring and manual intervention. Additionally, social trading platforms like eToro and Zulu Trade have further expanded Mrs. Watanabe's legacy, allowing retail traders worldwide to connect, share strategies, and even copy the trades of more experienced investors. This increased accessibility has fostered a more collaborative environment for retail Forex traders, mirroring the community-driven nature of Japanese housewives who often exchanged trading tips within their social networks. These technological innovations have not only enhanced the trading capabilities of modern investors, but have also extended the reach of Mrs. Watanabe's influence beyond Japan. The rise of online platforms for retail Forex traders has created a global community where individual investors can adopt the same strategies that once revolutionized the Forex market bringing the lessons of Japanese housewives to a new generation of traders worldwide. The future of global Forex markets, Mrs. Watanabe's enduring influence. As the global Forex market continues to evolve, Mrs. Watanabe's influence on finance remains strong, particularly in shaping retail Forex trading strategies. The ability of Japanese housewives to leverage their understanding of interest rates, global trends, and disciplined risk management has left a lasting legacy on how small, individual traders approach the Forex market today. In the future, we can expect their strategies, especially those centered around the yen carry trade, to remain relevant as retail investors continue to seek opportunities in an increasingly interconnected global economy. The future of retail Forex trading is likely to be shaped by even more advanced technologies, such as algorithmic trading, AI-powered platforms, and decentralized finance, DeFi innovations, Yet, the foundational principles that Mrs. Watanabe popularized, strategic patience, focus on interest rate differentials, and diversification, will continue to serve as guiding principles for retail investors globally. As global economic conditions shift and new market trends emerge, retail traders will continue to rely on the strategies first championed by Japanese housewives, cementing their influence in the Forex market for years to come. Yen Carry Trades and their significance in global trading strategies. The yen carry trade strategy has played a crucial role in global trading strategies for decades, and it remains a key tool for both institutional and retail investors. Historically, the carry trade has allowed traders to profit from the difference in interest rates between Japan's low-yielding yen and higher-yielding currencies like the Australian dollar or the Turkish lira. The strength of this strategy lies in its ability to generate stable returns over time, provided that currency movements remain favorable. In today's Forex landscape, the yen carry trade still holds significance, though its appeal can fluctuate depending on global economic conditions and central bank policies. As long as Japan continues to maintain low interest rates, the yen will remain an attractive currency for borrowing, 
particularly when other nations increase their rates. For modern retail traders, the carry trade offers a way to capitalize on global interest rate differentials, making it a crucial part of their Forex toolkit. However, traders must also be aware of the risks, as sudden currency reversals or changes in global monetary policies can lead to losses, if not properly managed. The Legacy of Mrs. Watanabe in Shaping Japanese Forex Trading Mrs. Watanabe has left an indelible mark on Japanese Forex trading, influencing generations of retail investors and helping to solidify Japan's role as one of the largest retail Forex markets in the world. Her approach, characterized by strategic risk-taking, patience, and a deep understanding of the global economic environment, has become a model for how small, independent investors can succeed in a market often dominated by large financial institutions. The legacy of Japanese housewives in Forex extends beyond individual trading success. It has also influenced broader market trends. As retail investors in Japan grew more sophisticated, they began to move significant amounts of capital across borders, affecting currency valuations and even impacting central bank policies. This collective power of retail traders has reshaped how both Japanese and global markets view the role of the individual investor. Looking ahead, Mrs. Watanabe's strategies will continue to serve as a source of inspiration for retail traders around the world. Whether through the yen carry trade or other strategic approaches, her enduring influence highlights the importance of disciplined, informed trading practices in achieving long-term success in the Forex market. And now, as we wrap up this fascinating journey through the world of Forex trading and Mrs. Watanabe's incredible impact, let's quickly recap the key lessons you can apply to your own trading strategies. From mastering the yen carry trade to leveraging global economic trends, these insights are essential for anyone looking to make waves in the modern Forex market. So what have we learned? In this video and article, we delved into the significant role of Mrs. Watanabe, a term representing Japanese housewives, as key players in the global Forex market. We examined how these retail Forex traders have used innovative strategies like the yen carry trade, which involves borrowing yen at low interest rates and investing in higher yielding currencies to influence global currency trading and drive market movements. The unseen influence of Mrs. Watanabe. How Japanese investors drive global Forex movements. We explored the broader impact of Japanese retail investors, highlighting how their actions, often unnoticed by major institutions, have reshaped global Forex trends. These small-scale investors, by collectively utilizing interest rate differentials, have proven that even individual traders can have a large-scale influence on the global financial system. 2. Lessons from Mrs. Watanabe on dominating retail Forex From Mrs. Watanabe's Forex strategy, we derived key lessons from modern retail Forex traders, focusing on risk management, patience, and diversification. These strategies provide essential Forex trading tips for navigating today's volatile markets and achieving long-term success. 3. How tech innovations amplify Mrs. Watanabe's Forex influence We also discussed how modern technologies, like online trading platforms and social trading tools, have expanded Mrs. Watanabe's legacy, making Forex trading more accessible to a global audience. These innovations have empowered individual investors to adopt similar strategies and thrive in the market. The key takeaway from this video is that with the right knowledge, discipline, and strategic use of tools like the yen carry trade, even individual investors can succeed in the complex and dynamic Forex market. To further explore Forex trading strategies and apply Mrs. Watanabe's carry trade methods to your investment portfolio, subscribe to NovelsNet.com for exclusive insights and downloadable guides. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channels, NovelNet and Dreamwavers. You'll find valuable information like this, as well as entertaining and educational content for your kids, including the best kids' stories on Singer Kids' YouTube channel. You can find the links under this. In conducting this research on the influence of Mrs. Watanabe in the global Forex market, I relied heavily on scholarly work and case studies from various experts and researchers in the field. I have attached a reference link under this video. I would like to extend my sincere thanks to the authors and researchers whose work made this research possible. Their contributions to understanding the dynamics of the Forex market, particularly from the perspective of retail investors, have been invaluable.